Thank you so much for joining me. This is Game Edge. We are back in subsistence. All right, um, it's going to get dark. We've got to start getting ourselves ready and get some wood before the end of the night. It's not that we actually need as much as wood, but we can actually try and get a couple of things before the end. We have to eat uh, some steaks and stuff, uh, but I just want to get it before it gets dark. I just want to actually to you ask me if I could use a pick to chop down trees. Let's see. It's taking a lot longer than I don't think so. Nope. That cannot be done. So that's good. I know you guys were curious about that. No, it's not able to be done, so that's uh, good news. The game is properly balanced for that. That's good. We have to pick up this wood here, and that's the best way to make our planks, and also make sure you have firewood for the night. And we'll make sure we pull this off, and we will just do one last run here. We should make sure we're loaded. We're completely loaded. Oh, where is he? Oh, shit. I can't see him too well. Can't see him too well. It's gonna get dark. Take you. Oh shit! Where the hell is he? Okay, that second bark is not good. What is he? Level four? Oh shit! No. Not not interested. Not right now, at least. All right. Uh, it's getting super dark. Let's get inside our house. Actually, turn on a light if we want to. Here. And we also have a light here. It's gonna take up some of our resources and energy, uh, but I try not to do it. But still. We can actually just turn it on. It actually doesn't do shit here. <laughs> I'm looking going, we, maybe I should put them in the inside. It actually glows through the wall a bit. That's kind of odd. All right. Let's turn this off. Sorry for the darkness. We'll actually turn on a fire. Luckily enough, I can still see. Let's ignite this baby here. That's good. I think I have some uh, food upstairs that's left over. Let's go and check that out. Uh, we can turn on a fire here too. Does that have wood? It has some fuel. Let's dump some more fuel into it. Uh, right here, add fuel. Boom. I have nothing in render fat. No, that's good. All right, matches is not here, though. Huh, I didn't dump it in there? Really? All right, let's get this one second. I got matches up the caboodle here. Let's grab 10 more matches and move it up the stairs for a last time with a nice seat. I wait to be able to sit down on this. I know he said that we we're going to actually be able to do that later on. I don't think we can still do it. No. I've seen a couple updates, and we did have uh, Cole Games mention that we will be doing... Sorry, I'm just going to grab some of this, some of this, and we'll do three. Uh, he's actually going to be working... He's been working on multiplayer, like I mentioned before, but he's also working on other parts of this game. So we should get ready for I know that his ideals are there, and uh, farming and many other things will be added. So we have to prepare ourselves to, you know, for a brand new game, most likely on the next features that are going to be released. I know he's working on them currently, and I'm just waiting for that to happen. So when it happens, you'll be the first to know. I'll be behind that video as soon as it comes out. Again, the game is in phenomenal shape. So what I'm going to do, I'm cooking up the steaks right there. We make sure that we have all our ores going here. That's good. And this no longer can be put back in here, right? I can. What the hell? I couldn't do it last game. Let's see here. Oh, look at that. All right, cool. He didn't do that. Awesome. Awesome. All right, our water is okay, but we can actually just put... Let's split one of these. Right-click, split one. Split. Drop this baby in. Let's mix our berry, get our drink going. Gives us a little bit of fruit. And now if you look it over, it, it gives you uh, plus 15 veg uh, vegetables, plus 5 hydration, and 22. How much vegetables is that? So it gives you two more veggies with that. That's kind of odd, but it works. I'm happy. A little extras for mixing up things. Let's drink this baby up. And there you go. Should have brought up all our stuff pretty high. That's good. So we're not starving to death right now because we actually have vegetables in us, which is kind of nice. Let's hope to God we can get these cooked up and we should have enough energy to get rolling. Again, the pickaxe, if you missed last episode, we actually got the pickaxe. And that's pretty cool too. Now we also have a lock pick, which I can't wait to get out there and actually look for a new uh, case. I'm trying to see if we can actually get another one. Where are we at? 94. I didn't see the base really picked up very much. But I guess I didn't give enough time to actually do it. Here, is that cooked? Cooked steak. We're just eat it from here too. Look at that. There we go. Hunger's going up. Hunger's going away, I mean, but it's actually filling us up in protein. That's very good. There we go. We're actually quite healthy. And uh, since it gives me plus 
I'm not gonna... I have a lot of water, so I'm gonna split another one. Oh, that was actually our... Oops. Why could that be mixed? Oh, wait. There we go. Excellent. Alright, we're gonna drop off some of the stuff we actually got in here. To make sure in case we lose it or something happens. And we actually have some rounds I'd like to work on here. Let's see what we can make ourselves. We should have plenty with this, just in case. Carry that here. That's good. And actually, I'll drop off the circuit boards in this one or the other one. The circuit boards are here. Like that. And our nails will drop off there. We are going to be building by the next episode for sure. I just wanted to get a couple of other things that we're going to need. We need definitely wood and stuff. So we kind of have to grind out a little bit, but it's not much. Again, that's part of the game, so we just have to get used to it. And that is the fun of this game in its own way. Okay, now I'm going to put it Courage, and actually, while we're waiting, let's craft this baby up. I'll put that over here, and I like to have this nice and clean here. We'll put the pick here, lock pick there, and we have what? Ten shots. Wow, that's not very much left, is it? We're gonna have to be very careful. I'm probably gonna have to put it in a handgun, I guess, for crafting. Because right now it's gonna give us one, it takes one shell and four of these. Shotguns. Hopefully we can find that in a case. Yeah, I'm gonna have to craft this. Let's just craft them all up. We need these new without a doubt, so it's gonna have to be. Alright, cool. I'll put that back. Like so. There we go. Perfect. Alright, so as this crafts and our laser here is done, so now we have 25 metals and 31 of these. That's good. Well, this is going to be rendering some fat, too, to get some more biofuel to make sure our generator can keep on going. And we can actually, oops, render fat, drop it in here. And should give you back stuff that doesn't fill back up. It's 700. That should give us quite a bit. Just keep that fire popping. All right, so we can actually turn this on now that this thing is off. So the only thing that's running right now is the refrigerator upstairs. It takes up a little bit of energy. And this is actually doing a lot better. It usually tells us how much power. What the hell? So it tells us how much power through there and this one too. That's pretty cool. I'm trying to see that power manage. One second here, guys. Power per second at 129. If I turn this off. Interesting. Interesting. All right, cool. So we're almost finished. We're gonna let this render off. We have enough fuel. No, we do not. Let's make sure, because it's gonna let that render fat. Uh, we'll get some more wood. Add fat. Oops. Add fuel. Beautiful. And gives us back the wood, as you see. It drops it back right in. That's pretty cool. So if you don't know about this game, this is actually a solo developer who's made this game. His name is Cole Games, and he's done a phenomenal job. And I tell you, I, I'm absolutely amazed by what he did. Um, I don't want to go too far and leave this running. Biofuel is pretty heavy. It's 195. We'll let the base pull crack itself up to 500 like it, it can do. Uh, we'll just turn this off for now. We're not going to use too much of that. Now I wonder if I can just turn off the fire. I never turned off the fire to see. Should let it stay the same way for next time. That would be pretty good. And again, I just don't want to waste any kind of fuels or stuff when we're way gone. Alright, cool. We do have enough biofuel, so it's not like an emergency. If it was an emergency, I'd probably pull out and and let it roll for the entire night. Again, we have a level four wolf right here on the left. And we also have another case, sir. Okay, we should probably crawl to this. Keep a little bit of stealth. Oh, nice. That was well worthwhile. That's a nice grab right there. So we got shells, which is very hard to find. And we also got ourselves some shotguns, so really nice. There's another wolf right there. Jesus, we're surrounded. All right, maybe we'll take this way for today. Oh, but the lock crates are on that side. Damn it. All right. We'll take the high route. Take the high route. Again, we are also looking for minerals. They are all over these rocks and stuff, but right now, with a wolf behind me, I'm not interested as much to be looking around those rocks. Uh, oh, almost ran over that thing. Again, we're looting, 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 looking for new stuff. And right now we're full, so we don't have to start eating apples and stuff we don't need. Definitely nice to see 
the actual fruits and stuff showing back up. It's really been a hard one for a bit. Again, it's always about balancing, and that's what Cole Game is so great about. He really listens, looks at the videos, and gets it done. And that's why I'm trying to get these out as much as possible for us to see. Get I can't wait for new updates. I'll be I get we always look forward to updates, right? Easy access. Of course you want an update. Is that a crate? I don't want to waste. Shit. What level is he? Level three. Um Yeah, I guess we could do that. Sit. There we go. Be cool to get also a hunting knife too instead of an axe. I mean, that's gonna be for future for sure. I expect that's gonna happen. Uh, I don't see it staying with a axe to chop over and start butchering a an animal. Probably one of the most worthless things. I guess we have a super sharp axe. But all right, we got the meat here. That's cool. Let's go and check out that case that we that crate we can see right here. And tell me it didn't despawn on me or did I see a crate up here? Uh, tell me it wasn't a shadow. No, I'm positive we saw it. Again, they do can despawn. I've seen things just disappear and despawn. That's fine. We'll just deal with it. Move on. Oh shit, bear. Bear. Here's my bear killer. Alright, so that's good. We've seen some fibers. That's berries, okay. We are going to have to start chopping down trees, too. We need to get a little bit of everything on this run. I'm hoping for a nice lock crate. Oh, always hoping for that. And, of course, some fiber. I'm always looking around for bears and stuff, so sometimes I might overlook some of the stuff that we were passing by, and I don't mean to. I really, I'm trying to zoom around, looking around, but there's so much to look at. Uh, as this game comes out available on Steam, uh, hopefully not too long from now. I know he's got a couple of things he wants to work on before that happens. Uh, but again, keep supporting him. Go on to uh, you know, his page on Steam. Uh, you know, Give it a little thumbs up. Support this game. It's very much needed. Uh, the more you support, the easier it is for him. So it's, it'd be nice for you guys to at least go in there and support him. Also on Twitter too. You can always follow me on Twitter too at sorry, game edged underscore so it's game underscore edged and also have it on top right of the page. It's a lock race. It's a lock one. Okay, we're looking good. Please there'll only be one nice one. Oh my Jesus, mother of cripe. Wow, that's not bad at all. I like the little bit more bullets now, but that's that's a great man. I love you. <laughs> Shit. Uh, it's making me feel like I should have brought another lockpick and made the effort. You got to have to wait for 500, so it's kind of tough. I'm still not seeing these ores as much as I'd like to. I don't want them being hard to find because you don't want them to be too easy. But I would like to see a little more on this. Or maybe like a little cave area you can go into, not just on rocks. Yeah, it's kind of tough to find this area. Gotta watch out doing that. I can break my leg. I've already done that before. I did bring a splint, didn't I? I did not. Alright. Even more reason to be a little more careful. Okay, maybe on this hill here. Good lucky. I also like to see something else. I mean, when we're chopping down these trees, you know, they're all three right now. I know that's something they're going to work on a lot. I get it, but uh, I think I'm just talking as, as I'm playing here and trying to figure out different ways this game. Uh, I like to see, of course, the trees fall down. It'd be pretty cool. Uh, but, I mean, that's definitely in the future. Most of the time in the games, that's one of the last things you see. But uh, if it's a large tree like this, I'd like to see more wood out of it, if possible. I get it. Always oh, excited. Just as excited. Suggestion. <laughs> My God. Hello. Look how I'm stumbling today. My mouth isn't moving fast enough. All right. 
Oh, I'm not seeing this anywhere. I really should have a shoddy on me in case a bear pops up or something. As you saw last episode when that bear lunged at me. Oops, I saw some fiber, I think. It's so amazing because we used to have to just look for fiber and cases and crates, and now you gotta look for everything. Ores, fibers, everything's important now. No, I'm not seeing very many of them. I'm not sure if the spawn rates are generically put in there between cases. I don't even see crates as much as I used to. Which I mean, they have to be kind of hard to find. I get it. But it's just a little too hard now. Again, it's always about balancing. There's so many great ideas that Cold Games is coming up with. Again, a one man team, one solo developer before. I know I mentioned it, but one solo developer. So before you, you comment and stuff, just double check to see that this is one man who made this entire game. And he works a full time job and does this on the side to build this game. Lots of passion, man. Lots of passion. I mean, I understand that too, because I got a full time job too, and I, you know, make things, but videos and stuff, I mean, it's hard work, but again, cranking out a game like this. Definitely a lot harder. <laughs> Very impressive. All right. Again, let's get our shotty ready just in case. I really not planning to use any more ammunition if I don't have to. But if the bears jump up, they jump up. Oh, there they are. See how easy it is? If I was just running and I didn't stop for this rock, we were right in his face. That's one pissed off bear right there. Just to show you guys, get too close. Yep. Second growl, not so funny. Then he starts chasing you down. Oh, I see some fiber and stuff over there. Get fiber cordage, cordage is very important. And also we get berries out of these suckers, so. There you go, we got more fiber. And let's go here, cordage, cool, and planks. Okay, so we got a cube. We can actually craft while we're walking, which is nice. And hopefully this hill is kind of scary. I need to find some more ores and stuff. Which doesn't seem to be around at all anymore. And I say that just to see if I can find some more really quick. Come on. Come on. No, I'm not seeing him. Maybe I missed them. I'm sure you guys will make sure I'm aware of it, but I don't see them. Maybe it's on the top of it. And I remember finding some on this rock, and quite a lot of it, but I don't think I get up here. I almost feel like some days to die. I just need a couple of uh, the crates and just jump up there, but no, it's not going to happen. Okay. I am sometimes quiet because I'm looking now for animals. They can be very persistent. I'm trying to take you out. Crates are really not around. Well, I guess we're lucky what we found, didn't we? No, I'm not seeing any ores. Oh, there's a crate. We got, don't have anybody here? Okay. Could be over that hill, so we just be careful. All right, so we got some metal pieces here, scrap metal, and we also have some nails. That's a good find too. I mean, the nails are supremo, supremo important. All right, there's a spawn area here. Let's check those rocks down here and make our way back. Okay, we got a wolf on the left, whoops. Yeah, we got a wolf on the left. Again, we're gonna do a little bit more avoidance. Oh, I see a crate. Tell me that's not a locked one. If that's a locked one, I'm gonna cry. It's a locked one. I could tell from... Oh, God damn it. It's hindsight, you know? Damn it, I should have just gotten that damn thing.
should have gotten it. Now, I wonder if I can make the lock pick upstairs. That's what I'm planning to do on that base up, up on the uh, top. Where is he? Heard some grinding. Uh, some grinding. Some wolf growling around here. Oop, is that a. No, it's a leaf. Yeah, we're not seeing very much. I see that crate over there. That's the one we just went for, right? I'm pretty sure. Now I'm just like not sure, so I want to double check it. Oh, it wasn't. Okay, a protein. That's good. Let's eat that right away. Okay, we're running low. I mean, splitting this will be definitely the key to making sure you're okay here. Get a little more out of this. Get more of your fruits, so might as well do it. Drink. And we'll eat one. There we go. Cool. Keep the nutrition up. Let's see if we can get a couple more pieces of wood here. Here are any of those planks we should be crafting all the times. Because I want to be building. I want to be building. Time. I see that wolf back there, so hiding behind this tree, hoping to God he won't see us. There we go. Oh, another crate. Damn it. Right now they're spawning him. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What level are you? Oh, level one. I wasted shotgun on. Oh, he was close. He was close. Just gonna bag myself. I can't imagine being bitten. It's not good for us. <laughs> Shit. We'll go back and get his meat. Damn, I'm pissed that I used more stuff. Now it's at least two shots. Nice clean. I wonder if you can use a pickaxe to. I doubt it. No. Pickaxe will not let it happen. There we go. Butcher. Alright. Take this. Yes. Thank you. Some liver is really good. That's a very handy one. Again, looking for the ores, and I'm not seeing... I hope I didn't miss any. Really hope I didn't miss any. Kinda wanted to find some more. I mean, if they're in a case, is great, but I like to play with the pickaxe a little more. Um, let's craft this. Got a bear on the right, and we have a wolf. I'm listening for growling right now, just to make sure we don't get anything. Now, I'm gonna say that the ores are pretty much not here, or they haven't spawned in properly. No, there's nothing there. It's not worth killing an animal to get it. Yeah, just be quiet. There's another wolf on the left. Jesus. Area has a shitload of uh, enemies. Wow, there's a crate right there. Holy shit. Go opposite direction, quick. That wolf is chasing us too. Okay, let's take a run out here really quick. Make sure we're not going to get caught. The last thing we want to do is get caught. All right, we did it. I think we're okay. Don't usually see very many animals here, but now that I said it, I'd probably get jinxed in that one. Oh, there's one to right. Okay. The base is looking freaking nice. Still got a lot of work to do. Still got lots to do here. 
I wanted to play, play with the... Oh, the fire upstairs. I was like, what the what? There we go. I forgot about that. Wasted a nice amount of wood, I'm sure. Yeah, it's out. Damn it. Extinguish that. Again, look what he's done with this game, guys. Isn't that incredible? Wait until we can do the stuff that he's looking to do. It's going to be an incredible, incredible game. All right, we open up the fridge. Make sure we toss in all our beets in here. Nice and full. Perfect. And let's check out to see our amount of power we have. 281. It's going up steadily. It's a bit slow, but steadily. And I think that's going to be very imperative. All right, so we have the episode here. When we come back, well, hopefully we'll have a new update. That'll be very cool. And if not, we'll, uh, we're going to start building up the base. We've got a, quite a bit of stuff. I'll probably do a little bit of logging uh, on the side. It's because it's extensive. Uh, and it's just really boring to watch constantly me hitting a tree. And, you know, there's not much you can do with that. So that's going to be the part of it we're going to do on, probably on the side. Uh, maybe a little bit together, but most of the grind I prefer to do uh, on camera. But this one, definitely it's going to be off camera. So thank you so much again, guys, for being here. This is the Edge for Game Edge. I'll catch you guys on the flip side.